It's already one of the most dangerous spiders in the world and tonight a funnel web found in Newcastle is making history. Across the globe, a select class of spiders has perfected the use of lethal venom. These highly evolved predators employ sophisticated biochemical agents, either neurotoxic to assault the nervous system or cytotoxic to cause cellular destruction. Look how extensive some of these webs are. They just crisscross and snake all through this nice kind of loamy soil. Here, we detail the 20 rarest and most dangerous of these species. Number 20. Sydney Funnel Web Spider, Atrax robustus. In the suburbs of Sydney, Australia, the highly aggressive Sydney Funnel Web Spider, Atrax robustus, poses a unique threat. The danger comes primarily from males, who wander into human areas during mating season. Its potent neurotoxin, Atracotoxin, opens sodium ion channels, causing uncontrolled nerve firing that can lead to rapid cardiovascular collapse the spider delivers venom through repeated, latching bites with fangs capable of piercing fingernails. While an effective anti-venom has prevented deaths since 1981, an untreated bite remains exceptionally lethal. Number 19. Brazilian Wandering Spider, Phonutria ferra. The rainforests of South America are the operational theater for an active pursuit predator, the Brazilian Wandering Spider. Unlike web-building species that rely on ambush, Fona Utriafera actively hunts its prey. Its venom is widely considered among the most potent of any arachnid, and its tendency to seek shelter in human habitations, particularly banana bunches, elevates its threat level. When threatened, the spider adopts a distinct defensive posture, raising its forelegs to expose its large fangs, before delivering rapid, multiple strikes. Its venom is a complex cocktail of neurotoxins, primarily PHTX3, which targets the nervous system, causing intense pain, loss of muscle control, paralysis, and respiratory failure. The species' strategic threat is amplified by its behavior of concealing itself within clothing and footwear, increasing the likelihood of accidental human contact. Number 18, Northern Tree Funnel Web, Hadronica formidabilis. High in the forests of New South Wales, the northern tree funnel web, Hadronica formidabilis, is the largest funnel web species. With a leg span over 4 inches and fangs like a small snake, its size allows for a large venom yield. This rare species is exceptionally long-lived, with females surviving up to 20 years, and builds elaborate funnel webs in tree hollows. Its venom contains a high concentration of robustoxin, the same neurotoxin as its Sydney relatives, which is delivered via deep, penetrating bites from its massive fangs, causing severe symptoms in humans. Number 17. Southern Tree Funnel Web, Hadronice cerberea. The Southern Tree Funnel Web, Hadronic cerberea, an arboreal predator from southeastern Australia has venom considered even more potent than the Sydney funnel webs. Its primary threat is the wandering male, which can drop from its elevated position in the tree canopy onto a target below a unique attack vector. The venom's delta hexatoxins are highly effective against primates due to a theorized evolutionary anomaly. This species is extremely rare a direct result of its dependence on rapidly diminishing old-growth forests. Number 16. Chilean Recluse, Lojoseles Leeta. The Chilean Recluse, found in South American structures, is the most dangerous member of its family due to exceptionally potent venom. It can cause a severe condition called viscerocutaneous loxosalism, where its primary enzyme, sphingomyelinase D, enters the bloodstream leading to systemic damage and multi-organ failure. Clinical studies report a mortality rate approaching 20% for these systemic cases. The spider is also remarkably resilient, capable of surviving over a year without food. Number 15, six-eyed sand spider, Sicarius harni. The six-eyed sand spider of southern Africa is a master of ambush predation, using its ability to adhere sand to its body for near-perfect camouflage. Its venom is considered one of the most potent known, and critically, no anti-venom exists. The venom has a rare dual action, containing both hemolytic compounds that destroy circulatory components and necrotic agents that dissolve tissue. In the two suspected human cases on record, one bite resulted in the loss of a limb to necrosis, while the other was fatal due to internal hemorrhaging. 
Number 14, Redback Spider, Latrodectus hasselti. Across Australia's urban and suburban landscapes, the redback spider has adapted with remarkable success, becoming the leading cause of medically significant spider bites on the continent. Its primary threat is derived from its close cohabitation with humans. This species displays a preference for constructing its irregular webs in man-made structures such as sheds, outdoor furniture, and playground equipment. The female injects a potent neurotoxic venom containing alpha latrotoxins, which induce a condition known as latrodectism. Symptoms include severe radiating pain, profuse sweating, and muscular spasms. Untreated bites can lead to complications persisting for weeks. The redback is expanding its global range via human transportation networks, establishing populations in new regions. Number 13, Black Widow. Latrodectus mactans. In North America, the black widow spider is an iconic venomous species. The most dangerous spider in the country, and perhaps the most iconic venomous spider in the world. Its venom is reported to be up to 15 times more potent by volume than that of many rattlesnake species. The active neurotoxin, alpha latrotoxin, directly assaults the central nervous system. The primary danger is posed by the female, who is larger, and injects a greater quantity of venom. She is notably aggressive when guarding her egg sacs. Alpha latrotoxin causes a massive, uncontrolled release of neurotransmitters at neuromuscular junctions, leading to severe muscle contractions and potentially fatal complications. The venom is a complex mixture of over 50 distinct toxins. Climate change is extending the spider's range northward, introducing this medical threat to previously unaffected populations. Number 12, Red Widow. Latrodectus bishopi. Endemic to the palmetto scrublands of Florida, the red widow is one of North America's rarest venomous arachnids. Its extremely limited habitat makes encounters infrequent. This endangered species possesses a neurotoxic venom similar in composition to that of its infamous relatives. However, clinical data suggests its bite typically involves the injection of a smaller venom volume. This results in more unpredictable symptoms, complicating treatment. The Red Widow's primary threat vector is its tendency to build webs in areas where humans recreate, such as hiking trails. Its venom attacks the nervous system, causing muscle cramps and difficulty breathing, with children and the elderly being at higher risk for severe complications. Number 11. Brown Widow, Latrodectus geometricus. An invasive species successfully establishing itself in suburban areas worldwide, the brown widow presents a growing public health issue. While it typically injects less venom than the black widow, its venom is significantly more potent on a per-volume basis. The venom contains highly concentrated neurotoxins that attack the central nervous system, leading to prolonged and severe symptoms. The species is rapidly expanding its geographic range, adapting to urban environments with alarming success and displacing native species. Its danger is heightened by a tendency to build webs in children's play areas and outdoor furniture. A single female can produce multiple generations each year, driving exponential population growth. Number 10. Desert Recluse, Locusaviles deserta. The desert recluse, an elusive spider of the American Southwest, uses camouflage and a potent venom containing the flesh-eating enzyme sphingomyelinase D. Unlike the common brown recluse, it inhabits harsh, natural environments, making it rare. Its bite causes severe necrotic lesions that heal slowly, leaving permanent scars. This resilient spider can survive over a year without sustenance, and research suggests its venom may be even more potent due to the evolutionary pressures of its environment. Number 9. Brown Recluse, Loxosceles Reclusa Hidden within structures across the central and southern United States, the brown recluse is a significant medical concern due to its necrotizing venom and synanthropic nature. Its bite unleashes venom that creates wounds that can take years to heal and leave permanent disfigurement. The venom's primary component, sphingomyelinase D, destroys cell membranes, leading to uncontrolled tissue decay around the bite site. A key feature of its envenomation is the often, a painless initial bite with severe symptoms manifesting hours later. In severe cases, the venom can trigger systemic reactions, leading to kidney failure and death. The species is highly resilient, 
often hiding in undisturbed areas like closets, attics, and stored clothing. Number 8. Gooty Sapphire Ornamental Tarantula, Poecilotheria Metallica Confined to a tiny fragment of Indian forest, the Gooty Sapphire is a critically endangered tarantula, known for its brilliant metallic blue coloration. This stunning appearance conceals venomous fangs that deliver medically significant bites. Its danger is a function of its high speed, aggressive defensive response, and potent venom. While not considered lethal, its bite is known to cause excruciating pain, severe muscle cramping, and even cardiac distress. The unique blue coloration is produced by specialized nanoscale structures. Wild populations have been decimated by habitat loss and illegal collection for the exotic pet trade, where specimens command high prices. Number 7. Mouse Spider, Misulena Bradley. Native to Australia, the mouse spider combines the worst attributes of multiple deadly species. It possesses venom comparable to the Sydney funnel web, massive fangs capable of piercing leather, and an unpredictable temperament. A unique aspect of its defensive behavior is the potential for a dry bite, containing no venom, which creates uncertainty for victims. When envenomation does occur, the effects are swift and severe, requiring emergency medical intervention. These spiders construct deep burrows that can extend several feet underground. Research has revealed that climate change is forcing mouse spiders to venture further from their burrows, increasing human encounters. Number 6. Fringed Ornamental Tarantula, Poecilotheria ornata. The fringed ornamental tarantula is a large, exceptionally fast, arboreal tarantula from Sri Lanka, reaching a leg span of nearly 10 inches. This highly defensive spider can deliver multiple bites, injecting a potent neurotoxic venom. The venom, which contains unique compounds that complicate treatment, causes severe pain, muscle spasms, and neurological symptoms that can last for weeks. The species is endangered and faces extinction due to massive habitat loss from deforestation. Number 5. Yellow Sack Spider, Keracanthium inclusum. A common nocturnal hunter in North America, the yellow sack spider, Keracanthium inclusum, delivers a bite with complex cytotoxic venom. It causes slow healing necrotic wounds and contains anti clotting agents that can lead to prolonged bleeding. A bizarre attraction to the smell of gasoline often results in bites when people are working on cars, making this spider a unique urban threat. Number 4. Indian Ornamental Tarantula, Poecilotheria regalis. In the rapidly disappearing forests of India, the Indian ornamental tarantula moves with lightning speed through the canopy. This rare arachnid possesses venom that causes prolonged muscle cramps, intense pain, and neurological symptoms that can persist for weeks. Its danger lies in its incredible agility and defensive nature. When threatened, it can move faster than the human eye can track. These spiders build asymmetric funnel webs in tree hollows, creating death traps that can capture prey mid-flight. Habitat destruction has pushed this species toward extinction, making every encounter increasingly rare. Number 3. Hobo Spider, Eratigena agrestis. It's an aggressive European invader in the Pacific Northwest, and is known for its territorial nature. Its danger is compounded by poor eyesight, which causes it to mistake human movement for a threat and bite defensively. The spider's venom has been controversially linked to necrotic, slow healing wounds similar to those from a recluse bite, with victims also reporting severe headaches and muscle spasms. Number 2. Wolf Spider, Family Lycosidae. Found worldwide, wolf spiders are formidable pursuit predators. These aggressive hunters do not build webs for capture. They are living missiles equipped with potent venom that can cause severe pain and tissue damage in humans. What makes them particularly dangerous is their territorial nature and lightning-fast reflexes. Female wolf spiders carry their young on their backs, making them fiercely protective and more likely to attack anyone who threatens their nursery. Their venom contains compounds that can cause muscle spasms and nausea. Scientists believe there are dozens of undiscovered wolf spider species lurking in remote locations. Number 1. Goliath Bird Eater, Therophosa blondi. Deep in the Amazon rainforest, the Goliath Bird Eater is the largest spider on Earth by mass. 
Its threat comes from its massive fangs, capable of piercing human skin, along with its unique arsenal of defensive weapons. When threatened, it releases clouds of barbed, urticating hairs that cause severe irritation to eyes, lungs, and skin. These spiders possess surprising intelligence, demonstrating memory and problem-solving abilities. Their bite, while not typically lethal to humans, injects venom that causes intense pain and swelling lasting for days. Females can live over 20 years, becoming apex predators that rule their territory for decades. Tilda. So, what's your take on the danger these spiders pose? Share your thoughts in the comments, smash that like button, and subscribe for more fascinating wildlife content.